Okay, this purpose of this video is to show the proper installation of the Ghost Plate 2.0. You can tell from this particular car that it's all the plate is mounted in the rear almost straight up and down. Put a little level on it. Yeah, it's almost straight up and down. So this is an ideal installation. If your car is different and every one varies, you may have to put a couple of rubber washers at the back of the plate to make sure that the plate is brought forward so it is as straight up and down to the road surface as possible. The 2.0 from Ghost Plate comes with its own plate frame, although you can easily remove the film and put whatever frame you want in place. Simply remove the protective sheets off both sides of the cover and you're ready to install it. This is what the 2.0 from Ghost Plate looks like from the rear when anyone is following your vehicle. From overhead cameras, this is what they see. Once installed correctly, the Ghost Plate 2.0 is visible from the rear and from either side. The intended purpose is to make sure that overhead cameras cannot see the plate, and as such, the plate must be installed perpendicular to the ground. Whether you want privacy for your plate in your vehicle from cameras, from the paparazzi or from toll cameras. Make sure that if your vehicle is equipped with a front and rear plate, that you get a two plate pack. If your state or province only uses a single plate in the rear, then a single plate. Both are available from Ghost Plate. 